These are some of the fastest rap albums that were ever recorded, starting off with Drake and Future's What a Time to Be Alive, which was recorded in just six days in Atlanta. And what's crazy is that Jumpman was the last song they made for that album, so they kind of just hit the buzzer beater on that one. But next up, Juice World's Death Race for Love, only made in four days, and Juice World freestyled the entire thing, and yet it ended up being certified two times platinum and having a bunch of hit songs. And last but not least on my list is actually Dreamville's Revenge of the Dreamers 3, which was made in only 10 days, which is absolutely crazy because 343 artists pulled up to studio sessions and over 140 songs were made for that album. It's true. And they had to cut that down to only 18 songs and only 35 different artists appearing on that project. So which one is the most impressive in terms of like what the final product was for you? Probably Revenge of the Dreamers 3. I mean, imagine having that many artists and producers coming through to the studio and like you end up making that end product in 10 days. Very impressive on their part. 